Welcome to Whiteboard Wednesdays, Real Talk with a Real Tour. I'm Sharice Wynn, also known as the Agent Lady. And today, guys, we are going to talk about LNI certification. What is LNI certification? Well, it's pretty much a property cert from Philadelphia, making sure that there's no violations on the property. So, what type of violations does LNI look for? Well, shabby properties. <laughs> so, if the house is vacant, you need a vacant license. It's about $50 for the year. Make sure you get one of those. It just makes your life a little easier. Broken windows, debris, trash. Um, I've even seen recycling put in regular trash they'll find you for. Grass, if your grass is too high. I know, right? Grass, Philadelphia, especially in the front. Um, but something to take into consideration. So you want to make sure that there's no violations on the property. And if it is, then it's up for the seller to clear those and for LNI to come back out and make sure that it's done. Um, how much and who pays for it? The seller pays for it. So what happens is our, um, the listing company orders it and the seller reimburses um, that company for ordering it. And it's about $113. So just make sure it's ordered in a timely fashion. Um, actually, on multifamilies, it takes a little bit more time to actually get that back. So you want to do it in a, a significant amount of time before closing to make sure that you're good to go. Because one of the things that they also track is to make sure that it's run under a multifamily, not a single family, as far as zoning is concerned. So that pretty much sums it up. Make sure you get one. Make sure it's clear. And remember, friends don't let friends buy or sell real estate without the agent lady. Make it a great day.